And so they started studying it and they said, you know, it seems like the the darkness of the pixels vary with distance to where the body would have been. And so parts of the body that are really prominent, like the nose, seem to have a, a more a, a more higher pixel in intensity of the color. And it kind of looks like a monochromatic image. And some of these guys are into medical imaging. And, you know, I know this from working with medical imaging. I mean, what you do is you you represent some characteristic on a monochromatic color scale. So in the brain, if you're imaging the brain, you might represent proton spin decay on a scale from black to white. And when you do that, you know, the gray matter might have a slightly different proton spin decay than the white matter. And you can kind of image things just mapping them to a, a monochromatic scale. And their idea was this kind of looks like that because it's one color, but it's just different values of that color. It's monochromatic. 